Hello friends, in this video, I'm going to do one example on again algebra, excellent question. Okay, let's read the question. Ahmed is looking at photos of different sizes from a portrait pack. The smaller photo is two centimeters longer than its width. Okay. So, and the larger photo has double the length and 1.5 1 .5 times the width of the smaller photo. So let me draw two portrait photos, suppose. One is a, a smaller portrait, but this is a smaller portrait, and this is a bigger portrait. Okay. I don't know what uh, what is the size, so let me read the question again. So what are they saying? They're saying this is a smaller one and this is a bigger portrait or this is a big, smaller photo and this is a bigger photo the smaller photo is two centimeters longer than its width so if this is this is the length and this is the width so what they're saying the length is two centimeters longer than its width so if width is w your length is two centimeters longer so that is w plus two does it make sense okay the larger photo, this is the larger photo, so this is the smaller one, so this is the smaller photo, and this is the larger photo. The larger photo is double the length. Okay, so what they're saying is, of course, uh, double the length, it's not drawn to dimension. Okay, so the larger photo is double the length, that means this, if this is w plus 2, this is 2 times w plus 2, okay, and 1.5 times the times the width of the smaller photo, so the width not draw, doesn't look to be not drawn to scale, so this is 1.5 times w, that's what they mean, okay, the difference in area between the two photos is 96 centimeters squared. So, so let me call this A1, which is the area of the smaller photo, would be W times W plus 2. Does that make sense? And A2 is the area of the larger photo, which is 1.5 W times 2 times W plus 2. Okay, so let us simplify this. So, A1 can be written as w squared plus 2w and a2 1.5 times 2 is 3w that is 3w times w plus 2 and if you expand this this is 3w squared plus 6w okay what does it what does it say now the difference in the area is 96 centimeters squared so what they're saying is a2 minus a1 is equal to 96 centimeters squared. Okay, so now what is a2? a2 is, uh, I'll write like this, 3w squared plus 6w minus w squared plus 2w is equal to 96. Let me change color. Let me make it blue. So this becomes, let me open the bracket. So this is 3w squared plus 6w. When you open the bracket with the minus outside, both of these terms would change their sign. So plus w squared would become minus w squared and plus 2w would become minus 2w is equal to 96. So let me collect the like terms. So I'll write like this. I'm doing more steps so that you understand. Minus w squared plus 6w minus 2w is equal to 96. So now this is 2w squared plus 4w is equal to 96. So if you take away 96 from this side, you have to take away 96 from this side. So this and this gets cancelled. So you have got 2w squared plus 4w 
minus 9 to 6 is equal to 0. I can divide everything by 2. So let me change color. So this okay, divide this by 2, divide this by 2, the whole thing by 2. So now this becomes w squared plus 2w minus 48 is equal to 0. 0 divided by 2 is 0. Now the two factors of 48 which gives you 2. Okay. So the two factors of 48 which gives you plus 2 that is plus 8 minus 6. So what am I saying is plus 8 times negative 6 gives you negative 48 and 8 plus 8 plus negative 6 gives me plus 2. And this, this is the plus 2 and this is the minus 48. So let me make it dark, darker. So this is w plus 8 times w minus 6 is equal to 0. So w, when if you set this equal to 0, so w is negative 8. When you set this equal to 0, so say w is equal to 6. Now, which answer looks to be sensible in, our, in context with this question? W is the width. Now, think whether your width can be negative. Okay. You would say no, width cannot be or can never be negative. Width always has to be positive. So, that's how you state now. But W has to be greater than 0, which implies W is equal to 6. So, the question was find the dimensions of the two photos. So you have got, so you can say the smaller photo, smaller had the dimension of W and W plus 2. So that would give me 6 centimeters times 8 centimeters. And the larger photo, what was the dimension of the larger photo was? 1.5, so this can we write, this is 2w plus 4, okay, and this is 1.5, so the larger photo has a dimension of 1.5w and 2w plus 4, which would give me, if w is 6, 1.5 times 6 is 9 centimeters, times 2 times 6 is 12, 16 centimeters. So let me confirm the answer. So what is A1? Area of the smaller photo would be 6 centimeters times 8 centimeters, which is 6 times 8 is 48 centimeters squared. And A2, which is the area of the larger portrait, is 9 times 16, or 9 centimeters times 16 centimeters. So this is 160. Uh, 16, 10 times 9 is 90, and 6 times 9 is 54, so that is 144 centimeters squared. So what did, what did they say? What did we write? We wrote A2 minus A1 is 96. Does that help? Uh, is our answer consistent with what we wrote? So we go 144, take away 48 which does give you 9 to 6. Am I right? Yeah. So you are perfectly right. So you should get an excellent.